Hi, welcome to excelrush.com. Today we are going to see how to generate a random text from a given list. It's not numbers, it's not dates, it's random text from a list. Let's say we have a list of cities. So we again write the same header here and we say equal to hlookup. Yes, we are going to use hlookup for this. We'll say find this city value here take all the cells f4 to fix these cells comma if i say 2 comma 0 i'm going to get ahmedabad because that's the second row if i take 3 comma 0 i'm going to get new york if i take 9 comma 0 i'm going to get dubai so in a way we understood that we have values between 2 and 9 so let's see how to generate this list automatically so i can say rand between 2 comma 9 when i do this I get any value between 2 and 9. Hope that makes sense till here. Now we are going to incorporate this rand between directly here. Instead of this, we will write that rand between here. So it will generate a number between 2 and 9 automatically. Now when you drag this down, oops, sorry, before that you will have to fix the J1 as well because that header cannot change. So when you drag this down, it automatically generates the list. But now you had to calculate this 9 manually. So let's say how to do that too. So I could have said count A of this entire city column. Why are we doing this? Because today it is 9. Tomorrow if you add one more city, you will have to go back to the formula and make it 10. So rather than doing that, we'll use the count A function which gives us that value inside the rand between. So here I will use it. And now I dragged it down. Now, even if I enter one more city, for example, Detroit, something wrong happened. So now we know that we cannot have F9 here. We will have to make it F to F. This is very important to remember. Otherwise, whenever you insert one more city, the same problem will keep happening. So this is our final formula where in the H lookup, you are saying find the city header in the F entire column. Why did we take entire column? Because we know that the range might keep on increasing. The number of cities might keep on increasing. Then instead of putting a standard value, we took rand between. We want to start from the second end at no particular value so we said count a of f to f comma zero and this way you can keep on increasing the list and your cities will get automatically generated from that master list that you have given thank you for watching